Namaste beautiful yogis, welcome to Ali Kamenova Yoga, I'm Ali and today is day 10 of our transformational love yoga journey and today's theme is healing because on our journey we went through some transitions and through finding allies and through leaving the old and venturing into the new and there is healing that needs to take place that's metaphor for life once we get on the journey called life sometimes there is pain involved we get tired of how intense things are and sometimes we need to slow down and take a healing phase of life or a healing class or a healing moment and today we're going to do just that we're going to have an in class perfect for before bed or when you're feeling stressed out and you need to relax and slow down and remember to flow with strength and peace We will begin in a comfortable seated position. Easy pose, cross-legged. You can sit on an elevated blanket behind you if that feels better on your joints. And we're just going to begin circling around the base of the spine. Very easy, gentle. hands on the knees, breathe. change the direction just do it in a fashion that feels good that's supportive and nourishing to you that feels nourishing it doesn't have to be a very big move back and drop them down lengthen to the crown of the head feeling tall here standing or sitting tall and let's bring the right hand fingertips pointing directly out and turn your elbow slightly in which in essence relaxes the shoulder away from the neck so instead of pushing here in this fashion we're going to relax and Lengthen the neck. Feel free to take the other hand up and over the head. Very gentle, not a big move. You can look up or look down or move the head a few times up and then down, lengthening the neck. Softening the face muscles. opposite side turn the right hand palm of the hand facing down so again the same alignment goes in the shoulder shoulder away from the ear we're relaxing the shoulders here you can turn the head up and down gently you can close your eyes or follow with your gaze this let's bring the left hand onto the right knee and look behind you lengthening again to the crown of the head relax the shoulders down opposite side 
without striving here or trying to go deep in a pose. Stay simple and be gentle to your body. Very good, inhale forward. And let's bring the feet of our hip width apart or a little wider. Bend the knees and lower your chest forward. You can grab your calves or your feet. Breathe here and you can rock side to side. both knees to the right so your left knee will be inside of the right foot and here you can bring your hands over to the right and back and do a gentle twist coming forward just switching the knees here and walking over to the left again lengthen the spine inhale coming out bring your hands behind you and just move your legs a few times this brings a lot of circulation into the joints healing for the hips spine do it in a way that is supportive of your body so if there is restriction somewhere somewhere honor that and stay a little less ambitious in the poses all right, coming out of this, we are going to bring the soles of the feet together and glide the heels away from you. So instead of the typical butterfly pose, we're gonna glide the heels a little further away from us. If you look down, there is a diamond formed between the legs and we're going to lean forward as far as we can as it, and as far as it feels supportive and nourishing to the body and stay here so we're calming the nervous system down rather than trying to achieve a pose legs behind us coming onto the knees and you can bring the feet together and the knees apart sit back and again here you can sit back on a block or on a blanket or even you can put the blanket between the legs so that you're a little lifted if that feels more comfortable otherwise this also is a very comforting pose and lower forward in child's pose feel free to have your hands underneath your forehead or forehead on the floor if your forehead is on the floor bring your hands by your heels and let your shoulders drop completely this is very good for the shoulders and back calming this 
class is great for before bed. Just listen to the sound of your breath. Inhale the hands over the head. Slowly and gently come up to sit. And we're going to sit down on the booty. Round the back, pull the belly in, and slowly lower yourself down here. Until you come down onto your back. Here we're going to open the arms out to the sides. You can turn the palms of the hands down and we'll do the same pose, knees lowering to the left. Into the right. Don't worry if one of your knees doesn't come down, that's quite all right. the right crossing and drop both legs over to the right and just look away from the knees looking over to your left and just give in to the pose give in to gravity soften as you exhale imagine all tension leaving your body allowing yourself to Stay empty-minded and present, present in your breath. By following the breath and the sensations of the pose, anchoring yourself in the present moment. There is a texture, a sensation to the present moment and as we experience the sensations of the body in the moment, we anchor ourselves into the moment. We become present and we let go of the worries of the mind. Exhale and soften here. Feel your muscles letting go, letting go of tension that we store and hold on to. Exhale. You can even exhale through the mouth. <sighs> One more time. <sighs> Inhale. 
hell slowly coming up and let's change sides right knee over the left you can bring your hips slightly up and to the right so that you can lower the knees and we'll go over to the right the legs and bring the knees together and keep them together and lower them all the way over to your right and you can bring the right hand palm of the hand facing up left hand over the right lower them down and then open the left hand up and all the way over to the left Close the hands together to the right one more time and open, exhale, soften. lower the knees together bring the palms of the hands together open the right hand up and back and you can do it one or two more times of a hug hold here you can stay still or you can rock side to side this is another calming pose allow yourself to experience the calming sensation that is produced in the body while we do calming poses
imagine that you're inhaling and exhaling through the third eye center between the eyebrows just bringing the breath or your awareness through there as if inhaling and exhaling through there which again calms the mind down Imagine yourself being an embryo surrounded by amniotic fluid in a safe and nourishing environment with your umbilical cord reaching down into the center of the earth, your spiritual mother or the mother energy, the feminine energy. Floating in safety in a peaceful place, protected. Use your top hand to press yourself up into a comfortable seated position sitting in Sukhasana easy pose all right so we're going to turn the palms of the hands up and let's bring the hands midair in midair and just feel the tingling sensation in the palms of the hands in the fingertips a moment to just inhale and feel the charge in your hands and the healing power there and just bring it over your face with love and be good to yourself be loving to yourself be kind to yourself never say harmful or damaging or judgmental things about your own self always be kind gentle and then let's bring the hands over the heart and over the belly feel the energy from the hands radiating towards your body inhale through the hands exhale through the hands and feel that energy vibrate nourishing your body, healing your body from any trauma, or pain, or hurt. Let's 
bring the palms of the hands together over the heart. Inhale through your heart. Fill your heart with gratitude. With joy. With laughter, lightness. And let's bow to our hearts for their forgiveness, compassion and love. Thank you all for joining me today for this healing class. Have a beautiful rest of the day or evening or sleep well. And remember to share this class with any of your friends or family that may benefit from it because that's the best way to support the channel and the message we're spreading. And make sure to subscribe and to come back tomorrow for class 11 it's going to be a very interesting one and i'll see you then remember to flow with strength and ease namaste